Have you ever noticed there is always sunshine after rain? It's all calm after storms and joy after sadness. It's all very simple and the things that we don't mostly think about. In this video, you will see the process of me drawing an elevation view of a building and listen to my learnings from Rainbow. The main lesson I have learned from Rainbow is to have rainbow, we need to have rain. Sometimes we need someone to help us move the clouds of our life and see the rainbow. That person can be a friend, family, or even ourselves. When I can't find anyone or don't feel comfortable sharing, I meditate and try to listen to my own mind and heart. That is my way of being the rainbow of my own life. Through this process, I also have learned the best way to be able to enjoy the most of rainbow sections of our life is to try to enjoy the rains of our life too. Following your dreams gives you power, or I call it wings, to be able to handle the pain or clouds when appear in life. For example, for me, having my own YouTube channel helped me on my self-growth journey. How? After all the recent changes on YouTube monetizing policies, I have not been able to monetize any of my videos. But because drawing is joy, fun, and one way of meditation for me, I still create content and upload regularly, same as before. This I call the wings that I have to being able to handle what has been changed or handle the clouds. We all can find little rainbows in each day to be happy about. Being alive and healthy. Having food, money, house, family, friend, or even being able to create content or watch this video. It's amazing how nature is and we have it around us every single day. When it rains, there will be rainbow. And of course, when it's dark, there is stars. Think about the stars of the darkest part of your life and have faith. Please subscribe to my channel and comment below my video your learnings of nature or rainbow. Also your thoughts or suggestions for my channel. See ya!